Good evening. Rima, good evening. How are you? Fine, thank you. And you? Uh, I'm okay. Thank you, God. So Thanks I think God. we are, we have to wait for the girls yes, to come. Yes, of course. Of course. Uh, maybe uh, next week we can uh, make um, our meeting uh, on Tuesday at 8 also. Only in Ramadan. Rima. Did you hear me? Yes, I yes. did. Uh, it, instead of meeting at 7, we have to meet at 8. This is what you mean. Yes, uh, instead of seven, because uh, yani Ramadan will begin fast. We, yani we have to eat at six. Ah, holy we God. Maybe, mm. Yes. By the way, uh, Mariam, I think I have to adjust all my schedule. And absolutely, I'm going Rima. to tell. Yeah. Ah, Rima. I'm going to adjust my <laughs> schedule. Uh, I know because uh, Ramadan, uh, absolutely, you will not be able to focus. So I think I'm, I'm going to do it. Yes, I am. Yeah, uh, okay. Because at 8, uh, we have time between uh, yani, uh, the, the dinner and yeah. the meeting. Mm, we yes, have time. Uh, yeah, I know. I know. I'm, I'm going to adjust your time. Uh, don't okay. worry. Uh, yeah, I will work about that. Yes, thank you. Hanadi is coming. Yes, she is. Mariam is coming. That's great. Let me accept Miriam and let's start because we cannot wait for more than this. So I think I have to start. Okay. So let me share the screen and let's begin. It is not uh, like this. So let me open the book. And let's start discussing something new. I know that we still have two questions about uh, the same topic, but I think uh, it's enough. We have to start talking about something new. Uh, this is it.
So if you remember, we have talked about age and annoyances. Now I think we have to start something totally new because we have practiced enough uh, about annoyances. Okay. So let's start talking about animals. Absolutely, animals, uh, guys, become uh, really important in our life. Uh, they take a good part in our daily life. Approximately, approximately, every family has a pet these days. So we cannot ignore their importance in our daily life. Okay, now Mahatma is saying the greatness of a nation and its moral uh, progress can be judged by the way its animals are treated. Absolutely, we have to treat animals in a good way. Okay, now let's try to solve this exercise, which is about vocab. Now, the first one is saying a doctor who looks after an animal. It's what? a vet. Vet, thank you so much. So, vet. So, vet is a person, or let me say a doctor. This doctor takes care of animals. Thank you so much. It is vet. Now, the second one is dogs often wear one of these around their necks. I don't know if you have heard about this noun before. Yes, of course. Mm. Uh, a teacher? Does... Yes. Let's drop the question. Mm. Vet is a noun or abbreviation? Because I know it as veterinarian. Or, yes. Or... Yes, exactly. It is abbreviation. Okay. Okay, but it is completely correct to say vet. Okay. Okay, so it's not, it's not that mistake. No, it's completely correct. It is existed in dictionary. So because it is existed in dictionary, absolutely, it is completely correct. Thank you. It's a good uh, uh, note. Okay. What about this noun? So dogs are often wear one of these. Color. Ah, uh, what is it? Amazing. Thank you. It is collar. C-O-L-L-A-R. Double L-E-R. Oh, bravo. So collar is a thing uh, that dogs wear around their necks. Their, uh, sorry, necks, yes. The next noun is something. Some animals have a long sleep in the winter. What can we call this? Hibernate. Yes, exactly. Hibernate. How can I write hibernate? H E. H E. Okay. H I. Hibernate. Uh huh. H I. H E I. Ah, H E I. Like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No. What? Uh huh. No. What do you think? No, we have one. Uh, H I. H I till now it's B R uh, yes H I B R hyper uh huh hibernate N N N A T A exactly N A T E hibernate so it is to sleep for a long period of time especially in winter like bears okay there is a sound. The cats, uh, wait, let me mute my phone. Okay. This word, guys, is cats do this when they are happy. What is this? Uh, roar, usually, roar. it's yes. a roar. Uh, okay. Roar. Hmm. Okay, guys, the, the, the letter that is written in bold, we have to start with it. Yes, this is, purr. Uh, it is per exactly. So per double R at the end. So this is it. It is absolutely the sound about the cats. Now uh, this it is word, not uh, uh, like a roar. No, roar is for lions. Oh, for lions. Okay. Mm. Because my cat is like a lion's. Holy God. Yeah, we can see a roaring. We can see a roaring. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> so you have you have a pet absolutely because I want to ask yes. you about your pet. Yeah. Okay. This word means animals that feed milk to their young. Mammals. Uh huh. Mammals. mammals. What is the meaning mammals. of mammals? Uh, Mummy fair. So mm. Mm. So that... Exactly. How can I write it? M. Uh-huh. A M A L M A L okay mammal M A M A L no M A M M A L aha M A double M bravo mammal M A double M A L so mammal exactly we are mammal yes we are thank you like humans like cows, cats, dogs. So all these creatures are mammals. Now this word means animals that have cold blood and lay, and lay eggs, like snakes. Reptile. Lay... Reptile. 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 Exactly. Reptile. reptile. What does reptile mean? Zawahif. Ah, exactly. How can I write it? R-E. Uh-huh. R-E-P-T-I-L-E. Oh, bravo. R-E-P-T-I-L-E. Oh, bravo. Reptile. Now, finally, this word means the noise a dog makes. Bark. Bark, exactly. So, bark. It's about barking. The sound of the dog. Yes. So this is it. Uh, this is about the vocabularies that we have to focus on. Vet, hibernate, collar, fur, mammal, reptile, and barking. Okay. So this is about vocab. And now we have to talk about idioms and collocations. Number one is saying she crept out as quiet as something, but the baby woke and started crying, we have to use one word of these. Mouse? Yes, as quiet as a mouse. Yes. Silently without making any noise. So, as quiet as a mouse. It is really a good idiom if you want to use it. So, let me cross mouse. Two, John is the black something of the family. Is, is the back sh uh, black Keep. sheep? Uh, um, okay. Black cat. Black cat. Ah, some say black cat. Uh, maybe one of you said a black sheep. Okay. Sheep. Mm. Let me skip this to solve the next one. This is a tough business. It's a dog eat world. Cat. Mm, dog eat a cat. Okay. Maybe it's the first time you really heard about these idioms. If you want to say dog eat a dog, this idiom to say that people are fighting to survive. Eat a okay. sheep. Ah, it's an uh, idiom, okay? It's an idiom. Dog eat a... Uh, wait, dog eat a dog. What is this? Dog eat a dog. Dog eat a dog. Oh, yeah. Yani, yeah. Ah, oh, okay. It is... Uh, yes, we got ah. it. And oh, bravo. Siraan, yes. al-baqa. So, business. Yes. So, dog eat... Dog is an idiom to talk about people are fighting just to survive or maybe just to prove the strength. This is dog eat a dog. It is really a good idiom. We said dog eat dog or uh, a dog, dog? No, I'm sorry. Dog eat dog. Okay. And if you notice here, we have world, so it is adjective. Now I'm so hungry. I could eat a sheep. A, ho a horse. A, a horse. What is the meaning? I, uh, the meaning of I can eat a horse. 
I can eat I'm a lot. I'm really hungry. I, uh, I, I can eat bravo. a lot. Yes. I'm really hungry. So I can eat a horse. Absolutely, I cannot eat a horse. But just to tell you that I'm starving, I'm really hungry. So let me cross horse and let me cross dog. Now who let out? The cat. Uh -huh. The cat. Let the cat. the cat out of the bag. What is the meaning of let the cat out of the bag? Yani if she said. Ah, bravo, reveal a secret. So let the cat out of the bag means to reveal a secret and told Anne about her surprise birthday party. So let me cross cat. So we have what? Black sheep. Thank black you so sheep. much. It is a black sheep. Okay. If you notice the description about the black sheep, he is always in some kind of a trouble. What does a uh, black sheep mean? Ah, bravo. Mushagab, bravo. Black sheep, mushagab. Guys, black dog, tani depression. The difference between black sheep, I don't know if the dictionary can extract this. Let me write black dog and black sheep just to show you the meaning because absolutely the meaning is totally different. Let me write black dog. I hope that this diction we can extract idioms. I doubt that, but let me try. Black dog, not black sheep. Uh, it's not literal meaning. Let me try to check the dictionary. Aha, uh -huh, this is amazing. Okay. Notice, guys, the definition is used as a metaphor for melancholy or depression. Yes. Okay, exactly. Notice the example. I'm, ha I'm very happy, but the black dog is here. Depression is here. It's not the black sheep. So please be careful because every, uh, 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 every meaning here, every word or two words uh, have different meanings. Okay. So this is it again. These idioms are extremely important. Instead of saying simple words, absolutely using idiom, especially if you want to be advanced speaker or writer, you have to use idioms as much as you can. What did I say? As much as what? As much as I can. Okay. I need you, please, girls, to be careful about using as, as. If you notice, see the example is saying, can one almost as, adjective as. So I can use as, as, absolutely, I can use a certain adjective in the middle, as tall as, as short as, as fast as lions, and the kick is... As powerful as, don't say as power as, because I told you adjective, a kangaroo's. However, their brains are only as big as a walnut. So I can use as as, and I can use a certain adjective in between just to call, to talk about what? Is it the same thing or different or more or less? The same. Ah, the same, exactly. But sometimes, guys, I can use many and much with as as. Here I have to be careful. By the way, let me show you the full text or the full lesson about as as. It is really important. I know that you know the rule. But sometimes, maybe you want to use much and many with them. Be careful because I'm talking about countable and uncountable nouns. Okay, as you said, it is about the same quantity or the same quality. If you want to take a look at this example, this example is saying, let's look at this uh, example. The Eiffel Tower is tall. It is taller than, this is comparative, the Statue of Liberty. However, it is not as adjective as Burj Khalifa. So notice that. I can use as, as if I want to talk about the same, but 
if I want to make the, e the meaning as just opposite, I can use not. So as tall as, not as tall as. In this way, absolutely, I'm talking about adjectives. The next example. This car is really expensive. It is more expensive than this car. However, it is not as expensive as this jet. So notice as adjective as. And if you want to make the opposite meaning, absolutely, I can use the negative before the first as. I know that you know this rule, but I want you to be careful, as I told you, with many and much. So if you want to take a look at this picture, we can notice that Ben is tall, Bryce is taller, but Ben isn't as taller as Bryce. So as adjective as, and I can use negative if I want, and I can use it before not. Now, I need you to be careful about much. If you notice that this example is saying Donald has a lot of money. Jeff has more money, but Donald doesn't have as much money as. So here as and here as. I used much because money is uncountable. Don't say as many uh, as money as much or as much as money. Absolutely, I have to say as much money as Jeff. Okay? Okay. This is about much. Let me show you an example about many. So I can say that here today, there are a fewer people. And there were many people on the train yesterday. So I can say there are not as many people on the train today as yesterday. So notice that I used many because people is countable. Okay? So this is it. And if I'm talking about the same quantity as I told you or quality, I have to say Janin is as tall as Jesse. So they are the same. So this is it, but as I told you, only be careful about using such, about using much and many, because sometimes I commit some mistakes in using them. So this is it about this exercise. Now I think we have to go into details, and I should start asking you some questions about animals. Can I start with you, Mariam? Yes, okay. Mariam, do you like going to zoos? Yes, I, I like very much to going to zoos. Why? Um, because it's very easy it's, uh, to look at uh, animals. Mm -hmm. And uh, there is uh, very strange animals and very, very um, um, rare animals. Which is your best animal, um, Mariam? Birds. The best animal, your favorite. A bird. Uh, a bird. Why birds? Because, um, uh, yeah, it's a uh, very cute animal and uh, 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 we, um, all of us uh, are uh, uh, pity, uh, uh, yani small animal, yani, uh, can you give you this uh, feeding? Mm. Okay. And uh, and birds uh, are very beautiful, uh, uh, especially uh, uh, those who uh, uh, are very, uh, yani who, who ha uh, have uh, uh, colors, many colors. Mm. Amazing. Okay. Mariam, you said all of us are pity. Yeah. yeah. What do you mean by pity? Any, uh, like Pluto. <laughs> uh, let me uh, write the sentence just to make sure about something. Let me open a new file. And I have to write the sentence that you have just said. Uh, yes. Okay. So let me write something 
you have just said you said uh, Maryam all of us are petty like this mm. uh -huh. is am I right yes what is the meaning of petty يعني في حنية عندهم يعني آه أوكي بس مريم بيتي is a noun أوكي you mean رحمة or شفقة but بيتي is a noun what is the adjective of بيتي who knows I don't know. It is merciful. Merciful, okay. Yes, so this yes. is it. Okay, okay. So uh, I know mercy. that. Mercy is a noun of Ah, uh, exactly, mercy. So I can say merciful and mercy is a noun, but uh, it's with I, sorry, not with E. It's with I. So merciful. So pity is a noun, be careful. It's you missed not... the C, yeah. Uh, okay. Can you explain? Uh... This this word merciful. I yes, merciful comes What? from the word mercy. Mercy is oh, right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is it. Oh, mercy. Merci, yeah. oh, it's and, French language. Pity, pity, uh, ah, pity, yeah. ah, pity, 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 So how uh, we how we use pity? Pity, pity is really important in our life. For example, how uh, 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 exactly? Okay. okay, as a noun. As a yeah, noun, it's exactly. different than merciful. Pity merciful, is a noun, it's but another merciful. word. It's another it word, is. but it is adjective. I think Maryam guys wants to tell you the adjective of pity. Yes. Am I right, Mariam? Yes, yes. Mm, okay. Uh, let me ask Hanadi. Yes. Hanadi, let me ask you the same question, which is saying, do you like going to zoos? Yes, I like. Why? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Um... Because um, first, uh, because I know that uh, my kids will enjoy, mm -hmm. so uh, I like going with them. And second, um, I like looking to the animals and seeing, uh, sorry, I like um, looking to the animals and mm -hmm. um, admire uh, the maybe uh, the creativity of Allah uh -huh. mm -hmm. and admire okay uh, I want to write something and first of all first of all I have to thank you I have to write mm -hmm. something okay uh, let me write the sentence uh, that you have just said I like <laughs> Uh, guys, wait, let me do something. Pity, the adjective is pitiful. But guys, pitiful هي حالة يرثى لها. طبعا مريم ما كانت بتقصد انه نحن مخلوقات يرثى لها. كانت بتقصد اه اكيد pity, pitiful is, is, is uh, adjective. But guys, uh, uh, مريم uh, means uh, merciful that we عنا رحمة. So uh, uh, we have to say merciful, just to make the point clear. Okay. You said, uh, Hanadi, I like looking and admire. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There is something wrong. Which is? I don't have to say I like looking. Why? It is uh, completely mm -hmm. correct, but it, it is only if you are talking about uh, general truth or maybe temporal action. Mm. 
Mm, I like looking at you, for example, it is completely correct. But any... Okay, uh, but because uh, there is two uh, verbs, yeah. Yeah, looking and admiring, yes, for example. Exactly. Or, uh, exactly. I like to look and... Can I say I like to look and admiring? No, to look and admire. Exactly. This is it. Thank you so much, uh, Hanadi. Mm -hmm. Now I think I have to ask Rima. Can you hear me? Yes. Rima, do you, do you like going to zoos? Uh, yes, of course. I like uh, going to zoos. But I don't know if uh, in Lebanon we have uh, some good zoos. What do you mean by good zoos? Uh, organize and uh, 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 clean, clean uh, zoos and uh, organize clean maybe or clean? more clean. Zoos clean. Oh. The, the zoos must be clean, yes, ah, because ah. animals live there, there and they must live in an uh, uh, environment. Uh, Yes, clean environment, and they must uh, be. They must take care of them. I don't know if we have some uh, good zoos here in Lebanon, but uh, I like to go when I am outside to go to see uh, uh, different kinds of uh, animals. Yes, of course, um, and to uh, watch them uh, how they uh, act when uh, they see people yes i like it you said uh, rima you don't know if there are some good zoos here in lebanon haven't you visited a certain zoo before here in lebanon no in lebanon no ah how strange i mm. i think we have we have where yes i took my children uh, last summer uh, mm. It's in Mansouri next to Juni, before before Juni, I think. It's so good, oh, you can good. try it. Oh, I know this yes, place. Okay. Yes. Can, can, do, you, do you know the name of the zoo, Hanadi? Um, I forgot the name, but mm. I can um, uh, I can look and uh, and let you know. Okay, yeah. good. Amazing, yeah. Okay. What is your favorite pet, uh, uh, Rima? Uh, in, in zoos, uh, I like to watch uh, uh, the monkeys. They Why? are so funny. Ah. <laughs> yeah, they are so funny. They are so smart animals. Uh -huh. But I, I think monkeys can destroy everything uh, around uh, them. These are really dangerous animals. Do you agree with me? Yes, of course I agree. But we watch them uh, uh, from outside. There are uh, uh, glass between uh, them and us, of course. Ah. But they are so many funny, so mu so uh, so much funny. Uh, they act. Uh, they act as. Uh, they act as people sometimes. Uh, they are funny. They are smart. Mm -hmm. I like it. Okay. Are they as smart as people? Uh, of course no. Uh -huh. No. Okay. Thank of you. course no. Uh -huh. Why? Why? Uh, I think too much. Uh, um, now, uh, let me call them. Uh, studies show that monkeys are really smart and they can do most of things. Uh, uh, which people can like, for example, arranging things, like writing some letters. <laughs> no, they can. No, I don't think so. Ah, they can do it. No, of course, no. Okay, thank you so much, uh, Rima. Sonia, what about you? Do you like going to zoos? Uh, no, sorry, I don't like. <laughs> Why? Uh, I don't like to Rima. go to zoos. Sonia. Sonia, uh, well, uh huh. Uh, 
I don't like uh, so much uh, the animals. Don't you I have... don't know why. That's mm -hmm. because, uh, mm -hmm. uh, especially dogs uh, and either uh, cats. Once, uh, I think because when I was uh, a child, Mm -hmm. uh, our neighbors had uh, a big uh, black uh, dog, mm -hmm. and I was afraid, uh, afraid from him or of him. I don't know. Uh, uh, of afraid of him. Of him. And uh, two times I, uh, I treated, uh, or I gave a treatment for. Uh, uh once i treated a boy who uh, who had an horrible accident with a dog the dog uh, bites him mm -hmm. uh, in front of his uh, little brother and uh, his parents and uh, it was a big trauma mm. um, so i don't like but sonia don't you Once have... I visited in Belgium, in Bruxelles, mm -hmm. I visited with a family, uh, with a Bel Belge family there. It was nice, but I don't like. Have you seen all, all kinds of animals there in Belgium? Yes, all kinds of animals. Oh, amazing. Okay. Yes, it was a big uh, zoo. Mm. Yeah, absolutely. The zoo should we be spent, big. Yes, we spent a, uh, the whole day uh, there. Mm -hmm. Ah, so amazing. Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, absolutely, as you said, the zoo should be clean and safe. Okay. Mariam, l let me go back to you, uh, Mariam. Mariam, do you, do you have any pets? No. Why, why don't you have? not. Absolutely. Because I, I live, <laughs> yes. First of all, I don't like... Uh, uh, the pets, really. Uh, I'm not very afraid uh, uh, of uh, them, but I don't like them. Uh, and uh, second uh, things, uh, I live in in the apartment, or and uh, uh, the apartment, I I it's not very uh, uh, yani, um, um um good for uh, pets uh, uh and um, i don't have a garden so no i, I can't uh, have uh, a pet. Hmm. so uh, 